Hello guys, welcome back to the next episode of Banished with me, Biffa. Thank you very much for joining me today. Oh, we finally got these little houses finished here. And you know what I forgot I was going to add onto the back of these little conservatories, wasn't I? To, uh, to increase the space that they can hold. If you haven't seen those before, we have a look at these officers' houses over here. Uh, they can hold sort of quite a few people. But on the back, you can add a conservatory... Which will take another small family. And I was thinking of adding them on here. And then I was going to add a garden. Let's just see how big they are. Um, it's this one here. Because I think once we've added those... Oh, it actually builds inside. Yeah, I don't think we're going to be able to add... If we added one there... Yeah, we couldn't add one on the next one. So actually... I think we'll leave those. There we go. And we'll go for some sort of far a farm, some sort of garden instead. Oh look, we've managed to get the statues built on here. Fantastic. Look at that. I like the look of that. That is looking nice. We're gonna build something around there as well. But let's see what we can do garden wise for in here. Um let's have a look. Let's have a look at these little areas that we've got here. So plant flowers, small fauna. So we've got individual flowers that we can plant, or we have the floor hedges, flower beds, that's the one I'm looking for. Complete one by one flower bed. No, these ones, yeah, flower beds straight. We could just add a load of different colour flower beds down here. Like that. Not sure that matters which way around that face is but gives the effect of a nice little garden in the back there and I may even just do the same at the back here there we go nice and we were going to keep this little bit free weren't we in case we want to do anything else what I would like to do is maybe expand that along there. Have the same houses here, but then keep this area free. So let's do that. Let's add that to there. In fact, we don't need to add another path that side. We'll keep this free. We'll do some sort of storage. I'm not quite sure what we're going to do there yet. But we'll add some more family townhouses. What have we got? Is anybody ever going to bring me any food? Oh, what's this one here? Oh, luxuries. Okay. Oh, well, we've got nothing to trade with you, so we'll say goodbye. In fact, this one, we're going to turn you off. There we go. Because we've got nothing there anyway. So there's absolutely no point. Um, let's add family townhouse. Let's add a couple more of these in. Let's see. That's one from the edge, isn't it? Can I do it this way? Let's adjust my view. One from the edge, and then we left a gap in between, didn't we? Perfect. There we go, we'll do that. We'll then plant some flowers along there, and then that'll be that. Yeah, excellent, good. So that'll look okay. And which one was it? Customizable, buildable doodars. Here we go, this one here. How far out does that go? Yeah, just to there. This one. Oops. We'll just go along the back. To the edge, that should be it. Yeah, that's fine. Just wondering whether a little path down the side. What I think we'll do here is a little dirt path, like it's down the side of their house, you know, out into the garden, that sort of thing. And what about around the side here? Maybe down the side here we'll do a little dirt path as well. There we go. And this side. Yeah, there we go. Just just something a bit different. <clears throat> Excellent. Then here we can add a little bit of storage. Oh, let me just have a quick sip of tea. Um, we've got nice little storagey things we can add there. Let's see if we can find them. Native items. Fort and palisade structures. I want to get into doing a fort at some point. Uh, walls and buildings for the shoreline. We haven't got to those yet. Decorative crop plants, decorative animals. And we do have a market going. <laughs> what is that? Is that a giraffe? Oh my goodness. 
We can build Noah's Ark, and we can have that going on here. Okay, decorative signposts. Oh, I haven't even seen half of these. Town decorations, that's what I'm looking for. Well, let's have a quick look at our trader. Nope. No, 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 no. Um, yeah, these look interesting, don't they? What have we got here? A pond. Oh, yeah. That'd be nice. Look, right smack bang in the middle of that. We'll have a pond. Large pond for another day. Oh, punishment area. Oh, look at this. My goodness me, we can have stocks, a hangman's noose. Wow. Let's have... Let's just adjust the angle on this a bit. Let's see what we've got. Maybe we can have some stocks here by the pond, so people can come and come and enjoy the pond. Have some stocks there. What else have we got? Scarecrow. Well, we've got a lot of farming stuff going on here. Can we squeeze a few scarecrows in? It looks like we can put a scarecrow on a path. Uh, Let's put one in the middle there and see what that looks like. I'm not sure whether that would be that would be good or not. Let's let's see. We've got stone benches. Okay, which way round do they face? Um, oh, I see. It's just that sort of bench. Got a bench with the back. What's that one there? A wood table and a wooden bench. Yeah, let's put some wooden benches here. So they'd come along and watch the people on the stocks. We can have some stone benches. Oh, there's different sorts as well. Okay. Let's go for that sort like that. A privy. Oh, we could we squeeze one of those in? In fact, if we took away... Nope. That bit of road. It should be this one, shouldn't it? Yeah, there we go. We move the road like that. Then we can add in. If someone comes along and does that. We can add in a privy. Is that let me build it there, or is that? Mm, I'm not sure. See so what I'm going to do. I'm going to prioritise the remove. It doesn't look like it's been removed anymore, does it? No. There we go. Let's get that removed first. It's privatised the removal of that teeny tiny piece of road. <laughs> because why not? Our food production's going up, which is good. <clears throat> uh, it's still two people with no homes. Oh, I'm very croaky today, aren't I? Still doing my recording session. To record as much as I can. 37 and we need 38. Yeah, okay, we're doing okay. Yep, there we go. Good, good. Let's get our privy in there. Oh, that'll fit nicely. That'll look nice right in the corner there. Good, good. And what I'm going to do? I'm getting to increase the priority on all of those things. But it's funny that the stone benches don't show up. Wood bench until they start working on them. Weird, but there we go. And then, what have we got at the end here? Ghost decorations. Oh, I see. <laughs> it was like actual ghosts. No, okay. We're not going to mess with those. We've got rocks and things we can add. Never seen those before. Crates. Yeah, I wanted to do something like that here, but now I'm thinking I want to make it look nice. Not a campfire. Fountain. How big is that? Oh, that's far too big. And the ponds that we've got. Well, let's wait until they're finished and see what they look like. Ah, oh, nobody's unhomed at the moment. So that's good. Approaching 400 citizens. Wow. That's nuts. Oh, look. Oh, no, they haven't finished them yet. That's why there's no flowers in them. <laughs> ah, there we go. Look. Very nice. I like the look of that. <clears throat> so things are going well. Oh, who have we got here? Let's have a look. Uh, firewood. We could do with some firewood, couldn't we? Okay, there we go. I'm going to say all design or... All this firewood and all this iron. Let's trade that and dismiss that because we're getting quite low on all of those. So I did remove a lot of my miners, didn't I? You're going to come in with stuff that I can't trade for. Let's dismiss you. I 
I've just remembered that actually. We've got six in here getting iron ore. And that's the only place that's getting the iron. Because that's getting stone that hasn't finished yet. So maybe <clears throat> we can add some more miners back in. Uh, let's have a look. Miners. Let's add another three in. Yeah. Hopefully that will help out. We shall see. Let's have a look over here, see how this is all doing. Yep, they're doing well, they're working on it. But what I want to do, while they're working on that, as we mentioned last time, I'm going to pause the game, because I want to work out some amazing fisheries to fit in here and to take up as much space as possible using these dock fisheries. Because I reckon we could, we could fit a load in here that would just be fantastic. Let's just let's just start off with one. Yeah, let's just start off with one here and see how we go. And see how many we can fit in. That's going to really help us leverage the best possibilities of fishing <laughs> from this I don't know why I suddenly come out with the business speak there. I'm going to try not to overlap them at all. And then, because if these are getting like a couple of thousand food each, a couple of thousand, a couple of thousand food each. Yeah, I'm not going to overlap there. Let's rotate you round that way. Or should we go that way? Uh, yeah, let's go that way because then we can have we can have some houses down the side here as well, can't we? Uh, what is it with my accent at the moment? I'm suddenly going all cockney on everything I say. Let's have one there. Actually, let's go in the edge. Yeah, let's go... Where should we go? If we go here, that'll probably be it, because these will be overlapping. Whereas if we go here and here, we'll get two more in. Yeah, let's do that instead. Let's go... One there. And then one here. And this will overlap a tiny bit. <clears throat> Not too bad. That's about as good as it's going to get, isn't it? Let's, let's do that. Look at all these dock fisheries. Let's put all those out of the way on there. So how does that look? That looks good. So if they produce as much as... Let's go over here. What these have been doing. Which for two people... I mean, one and a half thousand. Eight hundred. Over one thousand. So what would you say the average is there? Let's just say a thousand. So for two people, that's an excess of 800 food because take 100 each what is that oh it's a very slow flying duck that's an excess of 800 which means in here 800 times one two three four five which is going to be a very large number of extra food for those of you that are clever enough to do that in your head you've done it already 800 times five is an extra four thousand food for two, four, six, eight, ten people. What are we low on here? Reserve of logs is low. Oh my goodness me. So, oh there we go. Look, they're building already. <clears throat> yeah, we're going to use a lot of logs for those, aren't we? How are our foresters? How, what have we got? Twelve labourers. Foresters. We have a lot of foresters. Maybe, yeah, we're going to use a lot of logs for that. Hope. Hopefully we're not going to... Do you know what I'm going to do? Let's pause. Which one's that one? Let's pause that one. Let's pause that one. So those two are paused. And let's pause... That one's already started, isn't it? Let's pause this one then. Let's do a couple at a time. Because <clears throat> you've got to build the way to get to them as well. Man, I need to take a break and stop talking after this. I haven't recorded for... Let's have a look at this, see how this is going. I haven't recorded for a... Um... I want this to be built first. Let's prioritise all of that. For a week. I've taken like a week off. And then this morning I'm recording Banished until it's coming out of my ears. What's our population like at the moment? 368. Wow. More families than homes, so we do need more homes. 
They're taking their time with this. Don't think any of them needs anything special. These things don't, do they? No, nah, just logs and wood. Yeah, that's why we're using up so many logs and wood. Fuel's going okay, though. Oh, there we go. House is popping up. How's the market and bakery doing? Let's have a check out on that. A couple of hundred. A little bit of spare. And they're dropping it straight across there, so that's handy. You're getting the fish as well. They may end up adding some more houses. I don't know. I wanted to really make this sort of area in front of this, the courthouse, look good. And we will need to add another courthouse at some point. So we'll, yeah, we'll see how that goes. Oh, there we go, look. Oh, even the ones I paused, they... Oh, they started putting the stuff there. Oh, we might as well finish them off then. Look, they put the stuff there and then I actually built them. So we may as well finish them. Uh, these are nearly done. So I think what we'll do is we'll literally add... We'll get this as just straight out to the side as close as we can. Like that. Just straight out, straight to the side. This one... This one's going to go... Straight for a couple. Then it's going to turn the corner. That's what's going to happen here. Have I paused the game? I thought I had. Uh, where is it? Where's it gone? One there. And another one there. That'll be good. People still moving. No, I hadn't paused the game. Uh, that one, that one. Let's have a look. We may as well get these marked out. That was going to go straight out as well, wasn't it? And we're going to get some houses down here. So let's do that one too. One, two, three, four. Six, seven, and then we can get some, yeah, get some houses, get a bit of a shanty going. There we go. And yeah, these ones will go straight out as well. That's just the easiest way of doing it. That should be good for that one. And then this one. That? Oh, come on. Let's move that around a bit so we can see what I'm doing. Where's it go? One there. And one there. I just want to make sure that it reaches the edge. Okay, good. These guys are probably working hard here. Yep, that house has been finished. The little garden areas have been done. I like that. That's nice. I may actually change this. I've got it set as dirt. But they walk so slow on dirt. Do you know what? I'm going to change that up for stone. Do I need to... Can I just go over the top of it? I think I can. I'm going to go that all the way down. Yeah, we're going to change that. Although these ones, they can... No, he's cutting the corner there, isn't he? Maybe a stone on the corner. We'll leave that one. Yeah. Just so they move a bit quickly. How are they doing here? Yeah, they're using that as well. Let's turn that into stone. Let's turn all of that into stone. There we go. And she is as well. Okay. <laughs> this into stone too. Oh. There we go. I'd rather have them walking on stone. It is so much quicker. Oh, more seeds. I just have a quick look in case there's anything that we haven't got that would be good. Rather than just food. I mean, I'll, let's just leave that open a sec. Our trees. We've got... What have we got? We've got olives, pear, pecan, pear, pecan, maple. So we could... If there's any more... Like tree type seeds, tomato, tobacco seeds we don't have. Eggplant seeds, pea. I'm thinking tobacco good, it's not a food and it would be made into other items. Spinach, sorghum, watermelon. Gee, some of these might be quite good for their return of food and I don't know. Um, yeah, he's going to get dismissed. Thank you. But then. 
I mean, we're not going to get anything else from the farm supply, are we? Tomato, chickpeas, cotton, we've got, haven't we? Let's just double check. I'm pretty sure we're growing cotton. Yeah. Pepper, olives, cherry. Cherry. We don't have cherry, do we? We can grow cherries in a tree in this game, I believe. Chickens, black. Yeah, let's get cherry seeds. If we can afford it, that is. Let's see. Hopefully we can. Oh, look at all those candles. Yeah, we'll be able to afford this, no problem. Let's trade the candles. What do we need? 3,500. Okay, so we need a lot of those. 3,600. Let's drop that to 35. An additional 50 units, and we can do that with ginger. There we go. Dismiss. So if we jump over to here... Let's see, we've got pecan, pecan. Let's change this one then to cherry. Good, there we go. How's our dock fisheries coming along? They work. Oh, here we go, look, they're adding all in the extra ways to get there. Fantastic. And we've got a nice a load of spare labourers as well. Good, good. And all we really could do with is a house for each of these. <clears throat> And I'm wondering whether to add it on the side. And storage, of course, as well. That would have been easier to go here, but then they're walking around, so maybe not. Um, I'm just thinking. We've got a lot of stone, haven't we? Let's add stone houses. We could go stra straight up to Country House. Town abode, four families. I'm just wondering. I'm just wondering, I'm just wondering. Lumber, we don't have much lumber, do we? And we, we're in need in the lumber for the other houses. I'm thinking we're going to go straight stone houses here and then upgrade them. Uh, lumber zero, no. Let's go for, let's go for stone houses. I'm going to sort of put them... Not straight on. There's different sorts as well. Yeah, let's just randomise the randomise the houses. You can go up against the path here. Uh, who have we got? Oh, he might have food. Nope, llamas and bison. No thanks. Yeah, let's just put them around here, and then we can sort of work on the. Work on the paths and whatnot afterwards. And I think just this guy here. Oh no, he's got one, hasn't he? Yeah. And then storage. What can we do for that? Fisheries. Just a little bit of storage by each house. I mean, none of these are going to be looked after by a market, are they? We could have a nice little shanty in the middle here. They could all be attached to. Mm, I don't know. Nah. I want to get these working as well as possible. Let's add some more. Oh man, we are running out of wood, aren't we? Well, at least these stone houses just take uh, stone and wood. <laughs> okay, fair enough. Um, we could have sort of like a barn. He's going to store over here somewhere. Oh, is this... Ah, oh, this is actually getting built. Fantastic, finally. Okay, he will store around here somewhere. There's going to be storage. These two can have a little storage in between. Maybe just a small general purpose barn or something that's just going to take fish. Uh, let's have a look. Let's have a look. Bank barn, too big. Meat locker. Nut and fish. Yeah, that'll be good. Let's have sort of one of those in the middle between those two. And then we can have another one in the middle between these two. Yeah, why not? And then we'll worry about the roads later once they get building. Deeper small quarry. Okay, what can this do? Stone and salt. Well, this is not going to be worked yet. But this one over here is working away doing the stone. With five people, which is fine. Let's, let's upgrade that. Production, food's doing okay. Once we get the guys working here, this is going to be fantastic. These are going to... So, what are, do you know what? Let's just see. How's this going over here? All oh, the houses have been built. Fantastic. The benches are going up. 
They're like dumping their stuff here. I don't know why. I suppose eventually I'll probably fill those up with other things so they won't be able to. Hopefully. Let's just take out... Those few trees. Don't want those growing in there. Are we going to square off that path there? How far does that go? Let's do a bit of measuring if we can. Yeah, so that goes all the way. The gap is 10 stone. So let's see here where 10 stone takes us. 9, 10. Yeah, let's square that off there. There we go. That gives us two little areas that we can work with. Okay, oh, the paths are going up. Who's that died? Elsie the Forester's frozen to death. Oh my goodness me. I don't think that's anything to do with lack of this. Oh man, look at the fuel. That is fantastic. Over here, I just want to check out... Are both of these still set to lumber? They are. So both of these are set to lumber. Oops, scratchy head. So what is really helping is this stacks burner. I should have built that before. How's my coal doing? Because we are going to run out of coal at some point. Because I'm not actually mining it. 793. Coke fuel. Wow. That is fantastic. So that's really helped. Tools is doing okay. Got to keep an eye on that. I'd really like to add some more of these in somewhere soon. Oh, bison. How are they going? Two, two bone meal. <laughs> Okay, maybe they've only just only just reached 11. What have we got here? Oh, still use bronze, coke fuel, lumber, iron, building supplies, charcoal, copper ore, furniture, clay, joists. Oh, lots of stuff. But we can't trade. Ah, ha, ha, we got nothing. Oh, these are starting to get built now. Let's see if we can just speed these guys up a bit. By doing that. So we can at least get some people working here. If they do those first. Then we'll get the houses done afterwards. Okay, why are we just waiting for all of these to finish? I've just noticed here we have a real excess of... Oh, they're finishing. Let's just close these down. We'll head over there in a minute. Let's just pause the game while we talk about this. A huge excess of flour. So this guy is taking my corn, which people can eat, turning it into flour... Um, and this guy isn't working quick enough to make the flour into anything else. So what I'm thinking of doing, we've also got a heck of a lot of sugar canes. Is I want to add in a sugar house, which will take sugar cane and turn it into sugar. I don't think I've got a sugar house yet. It seems to ring a bell, but I don't think I, I've actually put one in anywhere. So I'm going to put it over here. This is sort of the area where we're making extra different types of food like that. Uh, let's change the view on that. There's the path there. So if we add that into there. So then we can take some of our sugar cane, turn it into sugar. And instead of making flour, uh, taking flour to make hard tack bread, we can take the sugar cookies. And I think that's going to be worth more trading. I think it will be worth more to them in food as well. Maybe provide some happiness, something like that. It might be that I even make... Do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to make another bakery on the other side. Um, smokehouse, bakery. Yeah, we're going to have two bakeries here. Am I taking up space from somebody else? Where does the hardwood forester go to? Ah, oh, yes, we are. Let's put the bakery this side. Uh, we're getting lots of hardwood. Not worried about that. Let's put the bakery this side next to this bakery. Where's the path? There... Yep, we'll do that. There we go. And then we'll have one of them working on sugar cookies and one of them working on whatever the other thing was. Uh, hard tack bread. Let's take a look at these. Yeah, these are finishing up nicely. Right, let's get some people working here. We want two working there. And here we go. This one's finished as well. Two working there. Yep. Nice. And we've got a trader. Let's see what he's got. Anything interesting? Herb seeds, fig seeds, corn seeds. Herb seeds. I'm not quite sure what they're for. Herbs, obviously, but... 
let's no, we'll save that. I, I always want to just keep a load of stock there for food and things. Uh, are these finishing? Almost, almost, not quite. But at least we can get these done. And this will give us an extra source of food from some. I mean, we've got so much flour; it's ridiculous. But it's a bit like the 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 bison and the cows. That's good. You can kill them, get food. But then you process that, you get more food. So we've taken the corn and processed it. I don't think people eat flour. Ugh, that wouldn't be very nice, would it? But if we process it, we'll get even more from it. So that'll be good. We've got tons of cotton as well. So we need to really build up making clothing. Extra clothing. I'm writing that on my list. Yeah. So we'll work on that. We'll see how that goes. But this is going to help a lot, I'm pretty sure. So we'll leave them to finish off. We'll get... Oh, here we go. More people on here. Let's add two. One. Two. There we go. We've still got extra people. Yeah. That's really going to boost our food production. And they're nearly there. And this, whoops, this is looking nice. There we go, we've got our punishment area in and some benches for people to watch. Although I've accidentally put the wrong bench in between there, but yeah, they look alright. Stone benches there, <laughs> looks weird, doesn't it? <laughs> oh, is that stocks? Yes, it is stocks. Someone can hang their head, hang their head in shame if they've been naughty. Well, guys, thank you very much for watching. I do appreciate it. Don't forget to be back tomorrow for extra Daily Banished. And uh, yeah, we'll see you then. Take care. Bye-bye.